How you doing today guys, Bomber here, and we're about to do another cleanup. Now, um, I had to take my tractor up to get fuel, so that's why we're doing it a little bit early today. But that's fine. It doesn't really matter too much, I mean we didn't get a whole lot, uh, a whole lot of buckets done today. I don't want that, I want to get that. I don't want it in there. That's up. Yes, so we have, I'll have a quick count. Oh, I suppose we'll get these ones. Alright, so we have four in the machine. Uh, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. We have another 14 day. I think it's because we started fairly, I started fairly early digging up the, the gold. I was uh, about 3 o'clock, I think it was, in the morning. I started mining again. So, yeah. That's that. Uh, that's running now. I'm going to turn that one on. There we go. Alright. Oh, we'll see how we go. We have zero gold right now. So at least we'll be in an accurate amount. That's going to be a small one. Very, very small. gold back here, that's for sure. I would like to invest in a drill machine, but you know, you need that extra day of, of um, just, just to build drill holes. So, yeah, we might be able to do something. I don't know. We haven't got a whole bunch of dirt left, really. Not to see. I mean, our open cut's fairly large now. I mean, we do have this whole area along the back here, but that didn't seem to be didn't have didn't seem to have too, too much gold in that. Oh boy, I don't think we might make 400. Oh no, we might make. really making it, the money was. Oh, 
have a good new hose, and get some new those ones up there as well, the jets. Turn all this stuff off as well. Fuel up this guy. 40%. That, I tell you what, that um, getting that mobile, ah, uh, that mobile, this big fuel tank, um, the, the, yeah, it's working. It's doing what it's supposed to do. It's great. <clears throat> tank is full of refuel. Thank you very much. Yes. Got two outs on this one. Two ins on this one. Okay. All right. How much fuel do I have? Okay. All right. Jump in the car. Oh, we got an excavator too, by the way, as you can see. There we go. Excavator. Dun dun dun. It was on sale. Twenty-three percent off. So I had to get it. I had to. I mean, since when do you not buy something that's on sale, even if you don't need it? You always buy it when it's on sale. So, yeah, it cost me <clears throat> 60000 I think it was, for that excavator. So, obviously, we dropped our money down from 80000 down to the 22 mark because of that. So, yeah, but it was on sale. <laughs> but it was on sale. On sale. Sometime today, perhaps tomorrow, we should get another person that wants to work for us. Let's just hope it's somebody we need. A mechanic would be nice. Got a lot of stuff that's broken down. Uh, can the wash plant um, bucket guy would be nice? But no, me, I'll get something that I really do not need. Also got the broken lights in our back, uh, in the back of our car. Uh, thinking I might just stick them aside. Yeah. And when we get a mechanic, like put them in like one of the, that little um, shop-looking area with all the shelves next to where they drop all the parts. I'm thinking I might put them all in there, and that way the mechanic can just work on the stuff that's in there that's broken or needs to be fixed. Our tyre on our truck is about to fail as well. There's a lot of stuff that's breaking down, obviously. 
it's autumn so everything seems to be wanting to go does say that on the game in the uh seasons section in your in the um what do you call it the journal there yeah in the journal there there you go autumn heavy rain electrical equipment is breaking faster wash plant is breaking faster because of the dense and wet earth vehicles have less traction storm yep thunderstruck yep and prices regular prices in the shop and then this one here the permafrost at the seventh day of winter you should not be in the field so we've got until the seventh of winter to get out i would probably take it to the fifth or thereabouts uh five minutes uh, we'll take this straight back home we'll sell it in the tent as we have we got lightning doesn't look like we've got lightning i thought it might be clear Right about now? 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 Go! Yeah, there. Let's go. Honestly, I don't, I don't understand why you have low beam and high beam on this car, on this game. It's like, yeah, you can just see. That's it. That's what you need to see. And it, it, there is no uh, negative side effects for using your high beam. Not that I've found, anyway. There doesn't seem to be any positive side effects for having it on low beam that I've seen, anyway. So I don't know why the truck just happen, happens to have to have a low beam or a high beam. Yes, it's more realistic, but I mean, lights on, lights off. You know, wax on, wax off. It's the same job. Oh, thank you. Sell that bar for what, forty thousand, thirty, thirty or forty thousand, I reckon. Thirty-two. Yep. Yep. We're gonna sell it. Did not get make much money out of that at all. And that's gonna end it for today, guys. Uh, I'll bring you back in on the next way up. Oh, look at that. That's that's not good. Anyway, see you later. Bye.